What's up everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how we use OpenAI to create a landing page for Balance One. What you're looking at right now is their current landing page. We found them on Reddit. Reddit has a forum called Review My Shopify where brands can go and post their landing pages and get feedback. It's important to note that they are not a client. We are just doing this for YouTube content and we wanted to improve their landing page using our proven conversion framework and open AI. So this is what their current landing page looks like on desktop. On mobile, it's kind of the same. It's super generic. It doesn't really have a brand. Um, it doesn't make you want to purchase. There's not a lot of credibility. It's a bit old school and it kind of mirrors the same type of quality and landing pages that you would find on Shopify. Uh, powered through apps like Zipify and Gem Pages. Not to say that they don't work entirely, but um, someone like myself and especially a lot of customers, they can quickly tell uh, that this is just a very put together templated landing page. Now, in order for us to be successful, we knew that that top fold real estate had to do as much as possible. You know, less than 10, 12% of your traffic is going to even get past the top two sections. So having that top fold real estate present your product, present your offer is super important. And when you land on this current landing page, the issue is they're using so much space for this text at the top. The product isn't the focal point and you just feel like it's not so much of a trustworthy brand. It seems like a generic landing page if you're just clicking randomly on Google and you stumbled across. So what we did is we used open AI and we uploaded their image, this, this exact image, we uploaded it into open AI and it generated an image based on the prompt that we gave it. Now the prompt that we gave it was, you know, create an image um, as the bottle dressed up as a warrior to symbolize it protects your gut. It fights for your gut and it restores your gut. And as you can see, that's the exact image we uploaded. And this is what open AI gave us. And as we've been experimenting more and more, we're, you know, not slowly, we're quickly starting to realize the power of open AI. Um, very soon it's going to be near perfect in terms of the, the renders that it generates. But for the time being, we're able to take this inspiration and go create it in Blender. And we were blown away with this image. We thought, wow, like if I was buying probiotics and I stumbled across this image in the hero, it's going to grab my attention. Here you see this bottle, it's dressed as a warrior, it's fighting for you, and it's so effective. Looking at the main image here versus this image here, you could see that this warrior style product bottle does so much more. It talks to your emotions, it makes you feel protected, and it makes sense. Probiotics are a defense for your gut. Um, so with that said, we knew right off the bat in the hero, we needed to catch attention. Now, jumping into the actual landing page, we used OpenAI to generate the copywriting and we used OpenAI to generate the images. Uh, be uh, beginning at the top, we utilized the announcement bar uh, to explain when the product arrives. Now, this would be dynamic in Shopify. If you were to build this in Shopify, you would be able to build in a, a dynamic functionality where if your average um, uh, delivery time was two, three days, you would be able to set it. And whenever the customer would come, it would be updated. But the idea why we parked this here is because it's important. Customers always want to know, when am I getting my product? You know, we're in the age of where Amazon could deliver in two, three days. So we thought it would be important to utilize this real estate, explaining to them, not only do you get free shipping, but you'll get it on this date. In the hero, we wanted to do as much as possible. So we have this incredible image. We have the hook and we have the promise. Now the hook is all about you, literally the copywriting, heal your gut, feel like you again, fights for your gut, brain and body. So when a customer lands onto this hero section, it's as if we're speaking directly to them. Below, they see this incredible image after they've read this copy. It's like they've hired a warrior that's going to go fight for them in their stomach. This guarantee badge also plays a big role. Customers want to know how effective it is. And the brand offers this. 
So they offer this guarantee that it'll work within 60 days. And that's what we wanted to really show. We don't feel like the text was enough. So we have it here in the hero. And I feel like we've marked everything. We have when it's being delivered. We have the social proof. We have the hook. We have the transformation promise. We have the product at the focal point. Underneath, we have these quick digestible USPs. Um, you know, more specifically, how it delivers 15 times more pri uh, probiotics, how it boosts your energy, focus, and mood, and how one tablet a day uh, gives you two months of gut support. Underneath, we have a descriptive call to action button. We don't want, just want to say buy now or get product. We want to say get 20% off risk-free. Why is it risk-free? Is because if you don't see results in 60 days, they give you your money back. Underneath, we want to agitate the pain. So this is a problem section. We wanted to explain what the problem is and why this product solves that issue. Now, if you've ever had probiotics or any other medication that is indested, that is indigested in a capsule format, you know that very rarely does that capsule actually um, get to the body. It doesn't break down in the stomach acid and stomach lining. And I'm saying this very poorly, but if you look at the research, we wanted to really pull that out is that probiotics die before they work. So here we're agitating the issue. And again, the, the call to action remains the same. Get 20% off, risk-free. This section here would be where you would have your, um, your references. So whenever you're using these type of stats, which we've gotten from OpenAI, so they're 100% legit, you want to reference them here. So we have this text here. It is dummy, but the idea here is that we're referencing the stats that we're showing and we're providing clear transparency that these are just not made up numbers. These are supported by studies and by data. Underneath, we then want to provide the solution. Now, this image as well, we generated in AI and it's incredible. Now, for this um, section, we're introducing the solution and you could see how it comes right after the problem. And it's kind of, that's the conversion framework is we want to talk about the problem and say, hey, but here's the solution. This is what we can do for you. Underneath, we then want to show the benefits, but, but we wanted to show it in a different way. Typically, brands like to use icons. We like to use a timeline. We want to specify what can I expect from this product? How long does it work? And as the user scrolls down, this section is actually interactive the ball would follow down with you and it'll show you what to expect. Day one to three, the reset. Day four to seven, the energy. Week two, digestive balance. Week four, full body benefits. And this is a visual timeline that talks about the benefits, not the features. And I've said that in my past videos, presenting the benefits is always gonna outweigh the features. Features are important and they can be placed somewhere else on the page, but clearly explaining the benefits is going to lead to higher conversion rates. People want to hear language that, that makes sense to them. You may feel lighter, less bloated, and notice more regular digestion. That is a true benefit. After the benefit section, we then go to the value comparison. So this is the cost justification. And we're starting to use this section to explain that if you were to purchase all these solutions independently versus this all-in-one solution, how much would you pay versus just getting it uh, one time? So the idea here is that we show all these different ingredients. So if you wanted to go purchase them separately, it would cost you, you know, $250 more. Or you could purchase Balance One that has all of these ingredients, solves all these issues for a small price of $25. This value comparison justifies the price and it reinforces into the customer that they're getting such a good deal. And I'd like to also just say that the storytelling um, and the layout is very specific. We're agitating, we're showing the solution, what they should expect, and why the price makes sense. Now underneath, we have the social proof. And as you can see on their landing page, the social proof was kind of just buried in the middle. Like you can't really even see it. And we felt that was an issue because in this day and age, social proof is so important. It's going to lead to higher conversion rates. 
And, you know, we're coming from platforms like TikTok and Meta and Instagram, where this is the media that people are most uh, uh, used to. So the UGC section is super important. It's going to build trust and customers are going to be able to see, uh, sorry, prospective customers are going to be able to see other customers with the product in hand. Next is the transparency. We want to show what ingredients they're putting inside of their bodies. Customers are becoming more aware. They're reading the labels. And the idea here was that we wanted to explain in detail every single ingredient that this probiotic has and what it does uh, once it's inside of your stomach. We have this accordion feature that if they want to read more in depth, uh, you can see what it looks like in this first frame here. Underneath, we have the bottom call to action. Uh, this is another guarantee, you know, see, like see results in 60 days or get your money back. We have another AI generated image and then the trust badges. Now, we did something differently here. You're probably wondering, where is the product section? We created a product section separately. Now, we would test both. We would have it on the landing page, but we would also have another test or variant where the customer would have to click through to get to the product page. And for this product page, again, we're using AI generated mockups, but the idea here is the same, is we have the product name, the product hook, and the costs per day, which is super important. You know, saying it's $30 versus, hey, it's less than only $1 a day are two different things. And it is a marketing gimmick, but it works very effectively. When you think about your health and you think about, wow, I could help my gut for less than a dollar a day, it's completely different than looking at the price of 30 bucks. Underneath, we have the bulletins, which are the emotional triggers. You know, it's going to be your immunity defense. It's going to be your brain boost, your mood boost, your advanced gut support. Below, we have the visual bundle stack. So if you look originally, the customer, what they do here is they just go one bottle, three bottles, six bottles. And that's not enough. Uh, we need to explain the value perception, the get more, the save more. And this is going to increase your AOV. If you get one bottle, you save 15% and it's 98 cents per day. If you get three, it's 20%, and it's 89. Offering this is going to 100% lead to higher AOV. Simply just having um, one, three, and six is not enough. You have to educate the customer. You have to show them the savings. And here, something super important that we add for a lot of our product pages um, in, in the supplement space is sometimes customers, when they're ready to purchase, they've already trusted your product and they want some guidance. So what we do is we recommend taking for three months for best gut result. And what this is going to do is they're most likely going to purchase the three months. That's going to uh, increase your AOV. And it's such an easy and small thing you can add to above this visual bundle selector that's going to guide people into purchasing more. Below, we have the, the subscription plan upsell. What we usually do is we have it pre-selected. Some brands prefer it not to be. We have it pre-selected under the most popular. Um, and of course, we have the one-time purchase. We have the big add to cart button, the payment badges, the social proof, and the transparent ingredients. And just to kind of show you the before and after, we think we did a really good job. And keep in mind, this is just a concept. This is not a client of ours. We just wanted to make content for YouTube. We used OpenAI, our conversion framework, and we designed what we feel would perform much better in terms of conversion rates than the current landing page here. Let us know what you think. And I thank you again for watching our videos. If you want us to review your landing page, comment below with the link and we will make a video on it. Have a great day.